Are you launching Blue Archive on Steam, only to get hit with this error? Fail to receive data via CDN. Please check your network environment. You're not alone, this issue is frustrating thousands of players, especially after updates or fresh installs. But don't worry. In this video, I'll walk you through the exact steps to fix it, whether it's a DNS issue, a region block, a launcher bug, or a misconfigured firewall. Let's get your game running smoothly again, right now. Section 1. What causes the CDN error? The fail to receive data via CDN error means the game can't connect to Nexon's content servers. Here's why it usually happens. Your ISP or DNS can't resolve the game's download servers. Region restrictions or server downtime in your area. Your Windows firewall or antivirus is blocking part of the game. Corrupted Nexon launcher or cache files. Or even Steam launching with bad permissions. So let's fix it step by step. Section 2, Quick Restart Fix, sometimes works. Let's start simple. Close Blue Archive and Steam completely. Reboot your PC. Launch Steam as administrator. Right-click. Run as admin. Launch Blue Archive again. If it works, great. If not, time for the real fix. Section 3, Change Your DNS, Most Effective Fix. This fix solves the issue for most players, because the default DNS from your internet provider often fails to connect to Nexon's CDN. Here's how to change it. Press Windows plus R, type nkpa.cpl. Press Enter. Right-click your active internet connection. Then Properties. Scroll down, select Internet Protocol version 4, TCP slash IPv4. Click Properties. Select. Use the following DNS server addresses. Enter. Preferred, 8.8.8.8. .8 Alternate, 1.1.1.1. Click OK. Close. Restart your PC. This sets Google and Cloudflare DNS, which work globally and resolve Nexon servers more reliably. Section 4, Clear Cache, Nexon plus Blue Archive. Next, let's remove any corrupt data that could be blocking downloads. Press Windows plus R, type. Percent local app data percent. Find and delete these folders, if they exist. Nexon. Blue Archive. Also navigate to your Blue Archive install folder. Steam library right-click Blue Archive manage browse local files. Inside the folder, delete any folder named saved or packs that looks broken or partially downloaded. Now verify the game. In Steam, right-click Blue Archive. Properties. Installed files. Verify integrity. Steam will re-download any missing or broken files. Section 5. Add game to firewall plus antivirus exceptions. Windows Firewall or your antivirus might be silently blocking CDN downloads. To fix this, press Start, Search Firewall and Network Protection. Click Allow an app through Firewall. Click Change Settings, then Allow another app. Browse and add. BlueArchiveClient.exe NexonLauncher.exe, if installed. Steam.exe Make sure they are allowed for private and public networks. Also add these same files to exclusions in your antivirus. This ensures no background blocking during download or patching. Section 6. Use a VPN, if region blocked or ISP blocks CDN. If you're in a region where Blue Archive servers are limited or your ISP blocks Nexon CDN, a VPN can help. Use a free or paid VPN, ProtonVPN, Windscribe, etc. Set location to Singapore, South Korea, Japan, or US West. Launch Steam, log into Blue Archive, and try again. Once the data is downloaded, you can often disconnect VPN and play normally. Section 7, Reinstall, only if nothing else works. Still stuck? Uninstall Blue Archive from Steam and delete any leftover Blue Archive folder. Reboot, then reinstall Blue Archive from Steam. 
Reinstalling after clearing local cache and resetting DNS usually fixes 99% of stubborn CDN errors. That's it, your fix for the infamous failed to receive data via CDN error in Blue Archive. If this video helped, hit like and share it with others stuck on the same screen. Still having issues? Drop your setup or error in the comments, I'll help you troubleshoot directly. Don't forget to subscribe for more fixes that actually work, no filler, just results. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next mission.